Hello, everyone. And today we have with us Mohit, and he's here to share his experience about blockchain. And we'll get to learn so many things. So let us know something about himself first. So, Mr. Mohit, tell us something about yourself. Hi, so my name is Mohit and I'm very passionate about the blockchain. I have worked on a blockchain and uh, I'm working as a software developer at Curl right now. And before also I worked on the various blockchain projects. I do uh, write blogs on blockchain, I create a content. So if you are uh, interested, please follow on my YouTube channel, subscribe on my YouTube channel and uh, see my medium blogs also. So in this uh, interview, we will cover the things uh, like how you can uh, enter into this blockchain field and like explore the stuff. Okay, so moving ahead with the interview. So Mr. Mohit, would you please tell us something about blockchain and why is it used? Yeah, so blockchain is a decentralized technology like uh, and uh, it's a secure technology. So if, if you go and see uh, tamper proof, secure, decentralized, these are the properties of blockchain. So uh, the whatever happening current in, in the current world, the, the product which are built, they have a single database. So it's easy to break the, reach the database and store the data. But it, it's not the case in the blockchain. Like the data is stored in the decentralized form. So, and, and if even if you want to hack it, there is a lot of computation power that you need, which is not possible in that particular amount of time. And in the DeFi also, like this is the only use case of the blockchain. Blockchain itself is a new internet era. So uh, there are a lot of things to explore, like uh, Bitcoin, DeFi, uh, this uh, like various supply chains, everything you can do almost. Okay. So at the moment, like blockchain is a hyped thing, what we can say. So yes. could you please elaborate on how to build a career in the blockchain? Yeah, it's hype now uh because a lot of uh, like a lot of the crypto things are uh, like people are getting to know what exactly the potential of crypto and how it can change the world okay so that's why uh, like people are started acknowledging good people in the industry there are some bad controversies also but uh, just uh, ignore that for now uh, so uh, if you if you go and uh, see the industry there are very less number of developers there which like industry needed industry want more developers to be there more people to get into that blockchain field so there are a lot of demand of the blockchain developers but there is not not much supply uh there are supply but not scaled enough so we want they want the scaled people to be there and they will pay you whatever you want if you uh, have that much skill okay so uh, like opportunities are there you just need to be uh, good at what you do and there are things uh, you you will find now the resources also before two years there was no much resources for learning the blockchain you just need to go to the papers and code on the github directly but now i think a lot of tutorials are also there like if you if you go to youtube or if you go to udemy um, so uh, if you if possible i will share the link we can uh, share in the description also and uh, like that uh, i also created a, a medium post so you can follow that step by step and create a blockchain and explore the stuff so yeah we can build a good career in blockchain and and the same position you are in right now if, if, if you'll see in the blockchain that is valued more because of the demand supply thing so that is one thing okay so tell us some of the best resources and the platforms that can that we can use for moving ahead with the blockchain yes uh, so there are lots of courses uh, on Udemy uh, uh, that will uh, teach you about the development. But before that, I will suggest uh, one course that is Blockchain Revolution by Dan Tapscott. Okay, that is in Coursera. So it's a paid course, like monthly 3000 something. But there is one option like financial aid. So if you apply for the financial aid, uh, you might get it for free after 15 days. So that you must try and that is worth it you will get to know about generally what blockchain is and broadly like what are the things happening in blockchain and i would suggest before starting that spend one month on that course and that so you will be sure what you are doing okay after that i will suggest to learn um, if you are going into the public blockchain i will suggest you to go and learn about ethereum solidity these are the platform for public blockchain and private blockchain if you want to go hyperledger is the thing uh, so uh, i will suggest like that and uh, documentation is also good. And there are a lot of YouTube creators like uh, 
uh, Gregory Dapp University. So these are good uh, for uh, reference and do the stuff. Yeah. Okay. So would you give us some tips of, uh, about gaining those all skills what are needed for being a blockchain developer? Yes, uh, it's a little bit uh, challenging uh, to learn these things than uh, like normal development, if we'll see, because uh, if you go, if you're stuck somewhere, you will face some problem. Uh, you, you'll go to the Stack Overflow or somewhere, okay? And you'll find a solution for in a normal case. But uh, in this uh, crypto thing now, it's not that like people not explore that much that uh, they will get uh, all the answers. So you might need to struggle a bit but that's what it's worth it for sure. <laughs> I'm sure of that. That's what you are valued more. That's why you're more valued more than them. Maybe that's what I'm saying. I'm not uh, cursing anything, but <laughs> like it's it's uh, related. Okay. All yeah. right. So any advices that you want to give us regarding the blockchain? Yeah, it's uh, it's, it's still early. Uh, the blockchain is still early. Like people say, Bitcoin is uh, now now Bitcoin is in high now it will go low. Just don't uh, worry about the speculations. Huh? You don't need to look into the prices or something. You just need to into uh, focus into the tech stuff. I always talk about this on my LinkedIn. Like people are very fixated on price. Like, are Bitcoin up jara and down jara. No yeah. man, you just like if you are a student and the things you should focus on the technology. It's beautiful. So if, if you go and develop something and it's it's a it's nice you should explore and i think uh, this is the right time like young people currently fresher should uh, like see and look into this thing because this will be a future i'm pretty sure uh, people started expect accepting the uh, uh, blockchain as a technology and various thing if you know i posted recently the cbsc result of 10th and 12th yes, yes. now get i shared that thing okay so that is now uh, will be verified and generated by the blockchain so there are a lot of use cases and uh, almost every company is using blockchain right now like big from fang to uh, like small small startups also everything so yeah okay so you know like your journey has always been fascinating what i know and being a software developer now you are a youtuber on yourself as well as the blockchain thing so mm -hmm. tell us something about your journey. Like how did you manage up to come up till here? Tell us yeah, something. So, about yeah, sure. Uh, so I started as a front end uh, guy first in my second year. So uh, the first year I'm just exploring stuff. I was in my class and people were like sitting there and uh, like class was happening. So uh, like people they were telling answer like C lecture was going on there. Okay. So I was like, what are these people, how do people know everything? I was like demotivated. I don't know like how these people know this before. So they had a CS in their 12th and 11th. Okay. So that's why they are able to answer those things. But I was like, uh, I need to work on this. So I started my journey from YouTube. Like, so I started watching YouTube video, YouTube content. So there were very few good creators like Hitesh Chaudhary. So that I followed. And I started, uh, I, I buy that course for uh, two, 1200, I think. Yeah that was a uh, 1200 course now it's cheap <laughs> but i think that course uh, i started my i started my journey with that course and as uh, after learning the front end uh, i started exploring the back end part uh, till my third year and i i also uh, worked on one startup of ours so we a uh, team of like 10 12 people built a startup uh, called becho which is a e-commerce e-commerce platform uh, that gave us a good uh, experience how exactly uh, startup culture work and like how the market is and like how the development things are there. So those things I worked in the startup. Before that, I got my first internship uh, uh, for as a React developer uh, in my second year. Uh, I, I worked there for two months. Then uh, I got a blockchain internship. Uh, there I, I got that there I got the exposure of the blockchain how that how is that exactly that things are so i worked with the various companies and uh, people and I, I i think uh if you will hang out with the good people now you will uh you'll you'll find a good way you will get the way and when you will hang out with the like uh, people that whose age is more than you 
you will get the perspective what we should do to maybe avoid it or maybe achieve it so <laughs> both ways and then as also uh, one concept i am um, uh, i believe in like learn in public okay so whatever you learn maybe 20% you should share it on socials maybe twitter linkedin anywhere because when we were, people will see you then only they will know you okay <laughs> and you you got to know various people you will get you learn more so that's how i think that, that is the reason why you also contacted me right <laughs> yes of course all right mr mohit thank you so much and we are glad to have you out here and thank you for your time and thank you for sharing your experience with us and for giving us so much of valuable information about blockchain as well as a software developer and uh, do, so guys do subscribe his channel the links will be in the description box below yeah. do follow him on his linkedin he has so much things to share and i think you guys should look into it so mr mohit would you like to say us something at the end so everything covered in this interview by the way but if you are still interested please uh, do uh, like follow me on the my socials so that i can tell more things and i can also learn from you guys so please uh, and thanks for uh, inviting me uh, sonia thank you so much okay